Hey gang, Jack Allaire here, and today we're going to continue the story of Caleb's adventure in Baldur's Gate 3. The first thing Caleb did at the beach was prove once again he is not a doctor, by taking someone who has fallen from a great distance and shaking them awake. Mm. You're alive. I'm alive. Thankfully, Shadowheart seemed to take this all in stride and even joined the party again. As our heroes strolled down the beach, while they looted the corpses of people after the crashing ship might have killed, they took their time to read a love letter. Since they found this letter on a corpse, I don't think things ended well for Anna and Sai. A little farther up the beach, they found a waypoint, which is this game's fast travel point. They didn't need to use it, so they just moved on to investigating the crashed ship, which of course led to another fight with intellect devourers. Back. One strike could be lethal. After those were finished off, they had earned enough experience to become level two. So they leveled up. They ran into a fellow survivor from the ship, and things did not go as planned. Not if you want to keep that darling neck of yours. But they managed to talk down Astarian, and he went to the camp to chill. Just the same as me. You approached. Still exploring the ship, our heroes stumbled upon a very wounded mind flayer. And after some mind games. Caleb stomped his head into paste. What's going on with that room? When Caleb and Shadowheart stumbled across a weird sigil, another waypoint, they decided to take a closer look. And this led them to pulling a wizard out of the wall. And Gale joined the party. Hello. I'm Gale of Waterdeep. A short while later, the party ran into a group of scavengers who wanted to lay claim to the entire ship as salvage. Caleb convinced them to leave it alone, as it is very dangerous and full of monsters. Well, uh, in that case, come on you lot, no point in getting killed. Second worm gets the cheese and all. Um, second mouse gets the cheese, no? Nobody's getting any damn cheese! Now move it! After that, Caleb, Shadowheart, and Gale quickly broke the floor and got involved with the first really challenging battle of this game. The battle took two attempts in total, and after it was over, the party decided to head back to camp and rest up. A lot of conversations happened at camp. Go to hell. But the heroes felt the need to return and steal more books. So many books were stolen. The group of adventurers discovered a dank crypt. And I couldn't stop laughing about this because it's a dank crypt. But since I was laughing too hard to control the game, uh, we'll have to see what happens to them in the dank crypt in the next video. Thank you very much for watching, and as always, play on!